everyone. I hope you all are doing great. You are welcome to Somia's Kitchen. And uh, the recipe today I'm sharing with you guys is called Nargisi Kofta. I really do not have a slightest idea why it is called Nargisi Kofta. Trust me, there is no Nargis in the ingredients. Uh, <laughs> but if you guys know that, do let me know in the comments, please. Uh, let me tell you what uh, ingredients you need for Nargisi Kofta. Okay, so here are our ingredients for uh, Nargisi Kofta. I'll be making Nargisi Kofta with chicken mince. I have this chicken mince, two LBs. And I have onions here. Uh, one onion is uh, just cut in four pieces. Another one is medium onion sliced. And I have ginger garlic paste here, uh, tomato puree, yogurt. And I have all these dry spices here. And uh, in, in that I have salt, uh, red chili powder, turmeric powder, and uh, coriander powder. Here I have these poppy seeds, one teaspoon, and a few garlic cloves, and just a half teaspoon of peppercorn, one black cardamom, four to five green cardamom, one teaspoon of uh, cumin seeds and uh, two teaspoons of uh, uh, roasted gram and I have these boiled eggs here, six boiled eggs uh, I have these uh, cilantro and green chilies as well so I told you everything, now let's begin so in a mixer I will add um, this chicken mince first and uh, this onion and just roughly chopped uh, green chilies roughly chopped uh, cilantro roasted uh, gram will be grinded together they are grinded so this is uh, almost blended now I will add all these masalas garam masala which I just grinded in here a tablespoonful of ginger garlic paste I need to add a few spices in it, salt, red chili powder, mix, mix now, now I'll just spread some oil on my hand and take the good chunk from here. Spread it well on your hand. Just hold the edges and just Then for half an hour at least. So in a pan and half cup of oil. Saute onion until they are golden brown. So these onions are brown now. I took them out. Put these onions in a blender. And uh, so at least half a cup of yogurt. And now blend them. Yogurt and onion mixture is ready. Uh, keep it aside. And the same oil. Add 
two tablespoons of ginger garlic. So add the turmeric, a teaspoonful. Red chili powder, a teaspoon. Teaspoon of dhania powder, coriander powder. So when the oil gets separated, add the yogurt and onion mixture. Cover this mixture for a little while and on a medium flame let it simmer for at least 10 minutes. And just a little bit of oil in another pan. Fry these koftas a bit so they don't lose their shape. So just after 10 minutes I'll add 2 to 3 tablespoons of tomato puree. As uh, you can see now, the oil is getting separated. At this time, add one cup of water. mixture to the boil and then we will add kofla in it. This time I will add these koftas. Cover them for a good 10 minutes. I would still keep it for at least 15 minutes covered on low flame. So in my opinion, they are ready. Whatever the dish you are planning to serve it in, you have to take the balls first. of tong and knife like that you have to cut them from the middle and make equal halves like this here you go Add the gravy now. Like the recipe, share the recipe with your loved ones, hit the like button, subscribe to my channel for more recipes. And don't forget to press the bell icon. Thank you so much for watching.